big, big move, big move. Are you gonna make it? Yeah, you are. These guys coming up behind me. The slow, methodical attack of the Asian wood turtle. Hey, what's going on everyone? We got some grub bag. We got a turtle treat bag uh, that was accidentally eaten a little bit by a rodente. Most likely a ratto. But uh, what a great time to do a video, hey? Eh? Let's go ahead and feed our wonderful turtles that we've got out here. Let's go for it. I know the fish will appreciate this, the turtles. This is crickets and mealworms, and it is all kinds of goodness. Let's get it all out there. Some shrimp. Oh yeah. And here comes one of the big badiger. This is the big female badiger. Oh, she got a little shy. Let's go ahead and poke you guys underwater. Just hang tight. There you go. Pretty cool one today, don't you guys think? I love it, man. The fish, the cichlids are so happy in this pond, and more importantly, the turtles are happy. It's a thriving ecosystem. This is the Royal River Terrapin. I love that big girl. She is doing so well, and what's neat about this is by putting these guys in this pond uh, and removing them from the pond that the alligators now inhabit, um, it actually, Man, it's so cool to see the fly river swimming around, to see the giant badiger in this crystal clear water. And they're really just amazing species. Let's see, is she gonna eat any of that? I don't know. Oh, well, she keeps getting so shy from me. The fly river turtles are floating around too. Where are they? My goodness, this is such a cool habitat, man. Uh, we built this in 2019. It was just basically a grass field here. Um, Aquascape came on in and they really changed my life. Uh, we use this pond all the time for ourselves, for the animals, and then native species come down here like birds, wading birds, uh, some native snakes, and it's really become a focal point here of the camp, which is nice. It's, it's just really, really nice. So we're just gonna let these fish and these turtles kind of munch on this fluker food. Um, this is good stuff. You guys can grab these also. This is the insect blend. Uh, really, really good stuff. It's got uh, dried mealworms, crickets, and some river shrimp as well. They aren't, they aren't insects, but just shh, don't tell anyone. Anyway, uh, the animals are doing well, but what do you say we head on over to the pond because the pond titles need some food as well. So I'm gonna grab this bag and I'm gonna grab uh, this bag. All right, and we're gonna grab this bag. So we're gonna take three bags. I'm gonna head on over to the pond just to see what's happening with those critters. Um, good times. Uh, I think Kate and Lobo are out here some, uh, somewhere doing some training. I'm not sure, but uh, I thought I heard their voices. Uh, anyway, let's move over here. There's one of the Asian, oh, look at this, two Asian wood turtles hanging out. They must have smelled the food. They have actually really keen sense of smell. Uh, they know when I'm about, look at this. How cool. Here comes our favorite little cooter. Little Florida red belly cooter. There she is, motoring on along. Look at that gal, isn't she adorable? She is not scared of me, I can tell you that. Let's go ahead and get some of this food out. Let's see what animals come out now to visit everyone. All right, there, well, we know she's gonna come out. Oh no, she's going right for you guys, look out. Let me see if I can turn her around. Let's just put this food in here. It'll spread on out, we got plenty of it. Oh, she loves it. These guys love it. Look at that, taking all that up. Really cool. Let's get some more. You're gonna see some fish popping it too real soon here. Oh my gosh, look at that. Yeah, here go the fish. We've got tilapia and brim and some Mayan cichlids in there. Oh my gosh. We're gonna get all the turtles over to hang out here with you folks. I gotta open this up. All right, very, very cool. Yeah, I don't know who's gonna pop up today. 
but it is cool to watch these guys chow down and hang out you can also see that the asian wood turtles behind me are going to make their way towards the water watch him they're pretty good at being on land they're going to hit four wheel low and just come on down that's a uh, four wheel drive off-roading joke there people uh very good look at this one here's a big move big big move big move are you gonna make it yeah you are good gal these guys coming up behind me the slow methodical attack of the asian wood turtle <laughs> awesomeness i just love how all these animals cruise on over to see what's going on don't you guys love it we've got yellow-bellied sliders we've got african mud turtles we've got asian wood turtles so many different species in this pond um, I was talking with Greg Whitstock. He was here not long ago, and I'm actually going to be heading to Pond Ammonium uh, in August. If you guys want to come meet me and you live in the Chicagoland area, go check out aquascapeinc.com uh, and look for their Pond Ammonium uh, page. Uh, or type in Pond Ammonium 2022, and uh, hopefully I'll see you guys there. Um, it'll be a real fun time. Watch these guys build different ponds. They, they are really talented people. Oh, hello, no problem. Ramming into other turtles, whatever. Um, but it'll be a fun time. I'll be there hanging out. I will not be at Animal Con because the dates conflict and I promised Greg and the guys at Aquascape that I'd be at Pondemonium and uh, those guys have done so much for me. So I can't wait to go hang out with them and support uh, a really fun event that I've been going to uh, for a few years now. So you can see all the heads and how the food has spread on out all over the place. This pond, um, I, I, that's what I was talking about. So I was talking about Greg. And when Greg was here last, he looked at this pond and he said the next thing he wants to do at the camp is he wants to build a wetland filter for this pond. What do you guys think? Would you like to see Aquascape come down here and help clear up this pond? Do you think it would be cool to go swimming with hundreds of turtles in this pond? we'd actually be able to do it and we'd be able to see underwater, which would be amazing. So uh, I don't know when they're gonna do it, but that is on the list of things to do here at Camp Kennan. These guys are amazing. It's a big undertaking, but I know those guys can do it. So check it out. Look at them, they're eating everything. Really, really cool. Hey, look who it is. It's Lobo and the love of my life. There he is. We gotta make sure the Lobo he used to come over here and he used to eat all the turtle food, but mama's got him on the leash and we've trained him and he is being a good boy. Although I can see in his eyes, he really wishes he could come over here and eat the stinky food. He loves stinky food, Lobo, don't you? Don't you love stinky food? He's doing so well, folks, with this training. It's so awesome. It was the best thing I ever did to kind of keep this dog uh, because he was getting to be too much, man. But we love animals here and we take that very seriously. So mom's working with him. I just wanted to uh, do a video with you, show you what's going on here at the old camp, talk to you about Aquascape and my friends over there. They're great people. And I love what they've built for me and my family and all the animals enjoy it most importantly. So that is very cool. This is all spread out. There are all the different turtles turtling around. I was hoping to get a little video of uh, maybe a fly river turtle swimming around. There's one way down the bottom there. You might be able to see it. Let's have a look-see. Oh, look, there's there's one right down there, guys. We're going submersible. There he is. So there's a fly river turtle. And I'm gonna let you guys in on the secret. We're gonna give Greg a fly river turtle. Don't tell him, but he's gonna get a fly river turtle for Aqualand. So uh, I'm so excited to give him one because he's really wanted one for a long time for, for their little zoo there. Um, I know it would be well taken care of and uh, we're gonna surprise him. We're gonna bring a fly river turtle to Pondemonium. We're gonna give it to Greg for everything he's done for us as a good friend. And I just wanted to give him something that he could remember us by uh, here at the camp. So okay everyone, that's what's going on. If you want to see more videos, you know what to do. Peruse the channel. Go ahead, click around. There's plenty of videos uh, in case you have missed one or 450 or however many. I think we're over a thousand videos. We've been at this a long time. Anyway, thanks people. I'm glad you're here. Because of you and your viewership, 
Uh, we get to do really fun videos. We get to transform this backyard into a reptile sanctuary paradise. And uh, I do appreciate it. You guys will. I'll leave you now with some more turtles turtling underwater. And some fun. See y'all.